Hi boys and girls, it's me Butch. <clears throat> I got a frog in my throat, but I'm going to try and teach you a quick trick about how to uh, snap up some of your photos. So uh, what I have open here on my desktop is GIMP, and that's a free program, uh, image manipulation program. I'll leave a link of how to get that. But any program will do that has uh, the ability to uh, adjust the curves. So I've dragged a uh, a photo here into GIMP and I'll make that a little bit bigger here and what we need to look for in GIMP is uh, colors tool up here and under that there will be curves and that will open up our curves tool and in a photograph your automatic camera will not usually deliver the full dynamic range because it's trying to do the best it can and it is what it is, so sometimes it's good and sometimes it's not. So you can see this gray area here, that's what's actually recorded in this uh, picture of the strawberries over here. And this line you see going from the lower left to the upper right, that's the blackest black up to the whitest white. And you can see there's a bit of white to the right of the gray here and the gray doesn't go over to the blackest black. Now by bending the curve, which you do by clicking on that line and pressing with the left side of your mouse. You can bend the curve all over the place and change the picture in all kinds of ways. If you don't like what you did in GIMP, you just hit reset. Uh, but the trick I want to show you here is bending the bottom of the curve. And that's to make the blacks more black. And because you've bent the bottom, it'll automatically change the contrast at the same time. So you bring your little Xy tool over here and grab the bottom of the this line over here, we're going to bend it down, we're going to pull it right down to the bottom there and that looks better than it was and this is just because I'm trying to show you roughly what to do. You'll play around with it and you'll get really good at it after a while. So we just bent the curve and we got to say it again, okay that's good. And then we go up to the upper left hand corner here, it says file, and I go save and GIMP will ask you what the quality is you want, I'm going to push it up to 100. I'm going to go save, and with any luck at all, um, it's going to be uh, saved. So I'm going to stop recording. I don't think you can see my recording program. So i got to push the stop button. hope you got the idea of that, how to bend the curve. Uh, if you didn't, just watch it over and over again a few times. And uh, just let me open up the strawberries there so you can see them again. This is in the photo viewer. See, that was a lot better than the flat looking picture. So now I'm going to stop recording. It's bye-bye from Butch. Three, two, one, bye-bye.